At the end of his life, Moses prayed to God over and over again, please allow me to cross the Jordan and go into the land of Israel. Our rabbis explain Moses' desire. It wasn't to see the beautiful scenery of Israel or to enjoy the magnificent air. It was to perform the commandments that were specific to Eretz Yisrael. Because out of the 613 commandments, many of them can only be performed in Israel. And that was Moses' desire. God told Moses, it's okay. <laughs> what does that mean, it's okay? The Orachayim commentary explains that God told Moses, look, you are the one who taught the Jewish people these commandments. So when they cross the Jordan and they perform them, since you taught them, it's as if you will be performing them yourself. What a magnificent message. We, all of us, impact one another. And many times in our life, we're helpful to one another. Sometimes we teach someone a small thing. Some, some, sometimes we teach someone a big thing. But, and we forget. We forget about the impact. God does not forget. If you help someone, you help improve someone's character, or you teach someone something about Judaism, about the Torah, and it helps them. A week later, a month later, a year later, 50 years later, it's as if we are doing it now. That which we forget about, and that which may appear small to us, God remembers and God treasures the impact that we have on others. Have a fabulous Shabbos.